hello my people. This is Nick the Booksmith and I've come back with the next journal to share with you today. This one is um, made for um, what I call the governess. She has been employed by a rich family and they have several children. So she's she's not one to have fanciful things and so this book, as opposed to having a bunch of ribbon clips and little charms hanging off the edge, this one has more secret pockets on the inside and um, that kind of thing. So um, this one is done in a very, very worn, uh, like a, I don't know, like a brownish red, like it used to be brownish red. <laughs> And um, the spine has these raised edges and gold gilding. On the front, this is, it's going to be too, sorry guys. Um, let's go that way. So um, this is probably the, the fanciest thing about this book is the cover and these, these raised flourishes. And then this book plate with these little, little birds on these little, branches. So that's that. All the tails, of course, lots of sewing in this one. The cheesecloth up here and down at the bottom. So nice big book, similar to the others, 160 pages, two inch spine, close to nine by six, just under, I think. And then the aged ribbon enclosure. So let's see. Make sure we're all in line here. So this one is done in some beautiful um, burgundies and foresty greens is kind of what I went for. Um, it's been all pieced and sewn together because governesses, they don't make a lot of money. <laughs> and um, so she does with what she has and she has tucked a lot of things in here. So we have the, um, the airmail love letter, which is, which is in the front. So I've added that onto this page, this little half page with this little sewn embellishment. Here's a photograph of the French ladies at the flower market and some old sheet music. Sheet music is from 1911. There's some random pages, of course. Lots of journal cards to write on the back. I left them blank on the back, so you can write on the back of those. Matte paper. There's the other side of that sheet music. And there's the date right there. Um, a photograph here. I imagine this is the governess. This is her... Um, groom to be and this is another pocket over here I've got some of these folded uh, journaling pages just kind of kind of tucked in all these little sewn spots here's a little collage on top of this pocket here another journal card there is a picture of her mother and herself and her little brother or big brother I guess there is a fold out and some graph paper and here's another big large pocket here all sewn with this ribbon on this side is a photograph in this sewn pocket and then on this sewn pocket there's a little piece of cheesecloth and silk twine and it's also a little pocket here with a little corset advertisement in there. On this side is a journaling page. Another journal card there. These are all blank, blank, blank. Some more graph and some lined paper. There's some tracing paper sewn on and a photograph of a little girl here. It's a little tuck spot down in here with my my shop tag. 
Here's a big stone pocket here with a um, little shipping tag clipped on. Some ledger. Another journal card. another big sewn pocket and then on the front is this little sewn pocket with a little stamp detail and I just tucked a little picture of a little girl in that pocket. There's another tuck spot on this side all collaged with some paper and all sewn together. There is a band here, that, a tuck spot. Here's a picture right here of this young girl on this page. more ledger. And then the back page has this pocket here with the ribbon and this little extra detail. And then on this side is a portrait of an older lady. So this beautiful paper, this is uh, my mind's eye paper, I believe, if I can remember correctly. Gorgeous. I thought it went with the colors of the cover really really well. So I made this to be very worn looking, very well loved and used, not opulent at all. This is this is a book that is to be used and um, things to be tucked in and memories to be saved and lives to be documented and so anyway. So that is the governess. Pretty, pretty. I hope you guys like that one. There we go. Um, thanks to you guys for coming by and hanging out with me for a few minutes today. I've got some more projects coming pretty soon. Hopefully a digital kit that I've started on, so that's coming up too. And um, I hope everybody is having a fantabulous day. And I will catch you on the flip side. Bye, guys.